Hey everyone, welcome to 31 Days of Horror. So we continue to review some awesome horror films during the month of October, and today's film is Scrapbook. And this one uh, definitely leans more towards the extreme horror side, which uh, I enjoy a lot of those films too. And uh, this one uh, I had heard a lot about. It's um, from Eric Stanzi, or Stanze, however you say his name, uh, who's directed some other things, most notably to me, Savage Harvest, because I'm a huge shot on video fan and he directed that film and I absolutely love it. That's the only film I had seen of his. So I was excited to check out Scrapbook and I've heard he's got some other films too that I'd love to check out. But uh, Scrapbook was really interesting and as far as like extreme horror films go, you know, sometimes they're just in it for the shock value and um, which is fine if that's what they're going for. But this film I felt had, even though it was shocking, it had a, a great story to it as well. And it had something that was intriguing that I had never seen in a film before, but basically um, it follows a serial killer, uh, and sadist, I guess, whatever you want to call him, who they kind of, at the first, which I thought was cool, show you his backstory, so kind of why, they kind of explain why he is the way he is, you know, what happened to him uh, in his past when he was a child, and it's very brief, but it, it you know, it sets up his character, uh, not in a sympathetic light, but just kind of an explanation as to why he is this person. And uh, then we jump right into, uh, you know, him kidnapping this girl, and uh, you know, he keeps her at his house, and this house is just, uh, wherever they filmed this was amazing, because it was just this rundown, in a just complete shambles kind of a house. And uh, it was just dirty and grimy, and you felt all the filth, you know, it was crazy. And, you know, he uh, definitely, excuse me, uh, holds her captive and, and proceeds to torture and, and all these different things, which I won't get into. You'll have to see it for yourself. And uh, long story short, the main part of the plot that I found so intriguing, uh, besides, you know, it just has shock scene after shock scene, um, is the fact that he keeps a journal, and that's why it's called Scrapbook, of his victims, and she is his last victim, is what he says, so kind of the end to his story. So he, he takes all these photos and writes all these things down of all his different victims, and you do get another victim uh, in this story too. Uh, you know, while he has her captive, uh, there's something that takes place with a guy who comes over to the house to ask him a favor, and you see what goes down there. But also, um, so back to what I was saying about the plot, uh, when it comes to that scrapbook, um, she figures out kind of how to manipulate him, you know, and she starts to write things in it to kind of manipulate him and steer him in a direction where maybe she could free herself, you know, by doing this. And it was really interesting because um, her character, even though she's scared and terrified, is actually keeps her wits about her and is very smart because there's a couple times she tries to escape and things like that. So uh, she's a tough character, and I really liked uh, the actress in this, and I think she's been in a few other of his films. I'll have to check it out, but like uh, she was really good, and I think she was really what kind of held this movie together as well. And um, it was a, it was a good film, and, and not just you know because it was an extreme horror film, but because it actually had some substance to it. And uh, it has a great ending that I won't spoil for you, but um, you definitely need to check it out. But I, it, I will warn you, it is kind of shocking. It is hard to stomach, and there is a lot of rough stuff in it. But if you can kind of sift through that and uh, see what the story is all about, it's definitely worth a watch. So I highly recommend Scrapbook. Um, I think you can still find this DVD for pretty cheap. It's put out by uh, Wicked Pixel Cinema. And yeah, it's called Scrapbook and a uh, great uh, addition to my extreme horror collection. And I recommend this film uh, for you to check out, especially if you're into this kind of stuff. So everybody have a great day. And uh, again, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And I uh, look forward to another review tomorrow. Thanks.